Criticate! All right, say what you were just saying. Okay. <laughs> well, Robert keeps trying to paint me out as this super negative That's guy. That's not what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm just trying. I'm, I'm super saying critical. I'll, I'll you're admit very critical. that. I, but I, I, I it does not come a place from negativity. I, I just want to hear things that you like about things, too. Okay, okay. Uh, so, so, like I said, I really like the... I like the the concept. So Sonic has has something unique that comes from its con its uh from its concept stages. We're like, okay, platformers are big and people love to speed run them. So what if we made a character that's all about speed? Yeah, that's that's smart. Uh, I just think that you should add on to that that players like to earn their speed. So mm -hmm. like they they like to earn in Super Mario when they go super fast and blast through a level. Yeah. And I think Sonic cheapens that sometimes. And, I, I and can I, agree with that. And I think I think that I really like the parts where they play with uh like like going backwards. Like this is this is neat. I'm going left to go right mm -hmm. to advance. That's that's something unique that platformers yeah. shit. And, and and I think the thing about two D Sonic is that it does have exploratory elements to it. Uh, and, but, uh, and Sonic Mario games are, uh, by the way that they're designed, not really replayable. I mean, I think they are. They're super replayable. Uh, you, go, you go into that. Explain. Oh, okay. Well, uh, just because they they hide secrets in uh, in unique ways. Uh, there's always you can always improve your muscle memory on how to solve things. Of course. Um, you can go back and, and find there's Easter eggs in a lot of them that, that you can. All right. And what's the difference fun. between that and Sonic? Sonic. The whole point is going fast. So exploring is a very inherently slow thing to do. Like if I were to go around and be like, well, how do I get to that part, this part below me? Well, I'll try going here. Nope, maybe I have to go over here. Nope, and then it slows you down. <laughs> what the fuck, how do you explore? I, I mean, you can still explore while going faster. It's just about thinking about what you're doing while going fast. Not, not really, because you have to slow down to find shit. It's just in, it's just how exploring works. You can't blaze through and find the secrets to every single thing. You could replay it, maybe, mm. but then I mean that so, that improves the muscle memory. Even so, you have to slow down while you're replaying it to find where certain things. Well, go. I feel like this game rewards ex exploration while you're running and just kind of taking jumps and leaps of faith sometimes with you finding those upper it, roots. And typically not, in Sonic games, the higher you are in the stage, the more the, the better. The better yeah. The better you're doing, uh, the more Easter eggs or whatever you find, the, the more I, progress. I you'll should make. I should kind of like uh, qualify that too, because I, I'm not saying that Sonic doesn't have good uh, like secrets and shit. Like I'm not saying that I don't rush it. Like like to find secrets and shit, and replaying it is fun. I'm just saying that a lot of times you still have to slow down and for a game that's all about speed. It it, it, it clashes with the mechanics a lot. Okay. And, and that's that's just like a, a baseline Sonic thing that they could fix, but don't. Mm. Well, I disagree. I, I think exploring Tips. while going fast... It's <laughs> I think exploring while going fast is, is extremely rewarding. And, uh, I mean, if, if you're going fast uh, uh, and, and going right through... It, it will, uh, there are, you know, you can go back as far as you want, but a lot of the times, if you go past a, a secret you could have just easily jumped and, and gotten, it, it'll lock you out. And then the next time you play the game, you're like, shit, I remember when that locked me out. I'm yeah. going to jump here. And so it, th this game is all about, you know, you're not supposed to play this game through one time because that's not how the game's designed. That's not how these kinds of games are designed. <sighs> but but I day. think that you should still be able to find secrets. Like, you shouldn't be locked off from secrets no, just because you, you don't. And you find some secrets. Uh, and you find some. Yeah, like like just by playing like normally without searching for any secrets, I found three chaos emeralds my first time. Uh, and so now going back, I gotta think about what are some of the things I could have done uh, while uh, while going to try and find the rest of those chaos emeralds. And so uh, and that unlocks the secret final boss is by getting all of them. And and that that's a grind. I mean, it, it's not a grind. It's, <laughs> that's a, it's replayable. That's replaying. I mean, yeah. that's that's you got to figure out the best routes to take to get all those secrets. But even if you don't, there's still it's still rewarding to just run through and beat the game. But there's stuff like eh, secrets are one thing, and I, and I agree with some of that. Uh, like, well, I agree with most of it really. But it, it's it's 
there's minor points of contention and like it goes into how Sonic's designed. But there's stuff like the thing back there where I have to wait for the platform. There, there's a lot of parts where they slow you down on purpose uh, to so that you can advance and if you don't slow down you die. Uh, I don't think there's any moment in this game. I mean you gotta Any think moment in this game where if you don't slow down you die? I mean if you I mean okay. So this is also a platform. So it's not all about going fast all the time. Uh, the I feel like that that's cheapening the concept of Sonic a lot more than than it, than it deserves. Uh, uh they, they, they always say, you know, it's you got to go fast. It's all about speed. Sonic's the speedster. Like if if it's all about speed, then then if speed is your reward, then going slow should be your punishment. I disagree. <laughs> I, 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 mean, I feel like, I mean, think about the characters like the Flash. Yeah. Going fast is his thing. Yeah. But he can still think when he's, like, in normal time. I mean... Well, that's because that's his superpower. We're not the Flash. That's I mean, kind of, that's part of the problem with Sonic. And yeah. that's part of the problem when, like, you play MMOs that make you a speedster. Yeah. And they're like, you are super fast. It's like, okay, but I'm not actually, like, in real life, I'm not super fast. You, you can't make me go faster than I can react as yeah. a player. And, and Sonic suffers the fact from the fact a little bit, I think, that you are not a speedster. You cannot react in super supersonic time. Uh, it's just not going to happen. And I think that it, it, it balances that by having moments where you do go slow and have to think <laughs> like a human being. I guess. But then, then you get into the fact that it kind of feels like a punishment, like you're doing something wrong. I mean, maybe that's to you. I, I, I've never had a point in Sonic where I, like, go super slow. Other than, like, like the game Sonic Labyrinth, where everything is super oh, slow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the game acts like it's your fault, even though that's the point of the game. Yeah. It's really weird. That's a bad game. But, um, there, where, where being slow feels like a punishment. It, well, like, what about this? Where I hang on to the thing, and it's, I have no choice but to wait. I have to fucking wait, and I'm Sonic. I want to go fast. I feel like that's just a problem with you. <laughs> you think that's a me thing? I think it's Come a you on! Thing. It's fucking Sonic! You're supposed to want to go fast! And I have to wait! What kind of bullshit is this? Well, get on the upper paths! Get good! I am on the upper paths! But you there's, are. Still, there's still mechanics that fucking force you to wait on okay. any path. So, so say there's there's uh, there's 12 acts in this. There, there, there's 12 stages in this game, each with two acts. Yeah. So you want 24 levels of this game to just be you moving forward and jumping over stuff? That's kind of the point of the game, yeah. You, you act like moving forward and jumping over stuff but isn't enough. But over and over and over and over that's and over again. That's what Super Mario is! Exactly! And I think that, that that's why Sonic had the edge over Mario in... in you, the, oh, not, you not do. the edge, not the edge, not the okay. edge. <laughs> uh, but that's why Sonic had an edge at points. Because uh. there were... And also, there's more things to Mario than just running and jumping. I mean, there's... Well, it's pretty much it. The enemies really balance it up, and it's and it's uh, it's all about. I'm supposed to go this way. I don't remember. I didn't go this way last time. Yeah, because you you're on a lower path. Because you missed it. You missed. Th oh, there was, was a spring that you hit on accident. Yeah. And then that permanently Shit. activates the spring, and it didn't let you go up to the higher path because because uh, it bounced you uh, down. Uh, and that that was on you uh, earlier. Uh, what spring? Oh, it doesn't it, it, well, yeah, it, 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 it goes by really fast. So <laughs> it does not matter. Mm. Eventually, you'll all, you'll get to the end. And one thing I do Ooh. like about the alternate path system is usually lives are put into oh, place. I hate that. You just keep holding one direction. I know, but it's it's counterintuitive. Uh, you're going left, so the your intuition is to go left. But yeah, it's but not. but the intuition would also be don't let go of the running the button. The intuition would all yeah, uh, but that's. That's inherently confusing. I don't agree. It, it is. You're 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 going left but holding right. I feel like it would be confusing to let go of the run button. It's when confusing you're... no matter what. So like that's that's why I have some problems with you know going left in, in levels. It's a clever design uh, choice to to try and oh shit to try and change up the combat a little bit or the the pacing a little bit. But come on, man. I mean, I'm going, in a game about going right, I'm going left. Well, that was my fault. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so say something you like about this game, <laughs> <laughs> I don't like a whole lot of, of you know, 2D Sonic. I, I mean, I've mentioned that. I've been honest about that, mm -hmm. pretty clear about it. I mean, I wouldn't like 2D Sonic if it's every game that came out. 
Sure. Because I, I, there, it's really hard to, to differ on this formula. I think this game makes good headway by uh, having a lot of those Sonic Easter eggs. Uh, and and e even even if you don't know the Sonic Easter eggs, there are, there's still things that kind of change up the gameplay and make you wonder, you know? Like, like what is that purple thing with the gun? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then it, it makes... It, it brings a, a, a mystery and an interest to Sonic. Uh... That, that I feel like severely is lacking these days because, I mean, everyone knows the fucking Sonic shit. It's just like, oh, he's, he went fast and I'm edgy and shit. Like, I'm <laughs> trying way too hard to be 90s. And this is, the, the thing about original Sonic was that he didn't try to be 90s. He, was. he just was fucking, <laughs> well, it was also advertising. Yeah, advertising yeah. is what put forth Sonic as cool in 90s. Whoops. In the games, he's just, it's just fun. And, and that's, that's a big misstep of modern Sonic is that when you're playing a Sonic game and he's being like fucking, ooh, oh, they're being <laughs> Sonic from the advertisements from the 90s. Yeah, they're yeah. not encapsulating what Sonic is. Yeah. And, and it, it, the coolness of Sonic is inherent. It's not part of... Well... It's, it's not... It shouldn't be like... He shouldn't try hard to be cool. Yeah, he, uh, he is cool. He should just do cool shit. Yeah, yeah. And he and he shouldn't have to be like, <laughs> kind of close, kid. <laughs> You're too slow. Yeah. <laughs> Sonic is just a cool ass dude. Cool motherfucker. And if you want to hear about more about how much I love the inherent design of Sonic the Hedgehog, check out the next episode of Criticade and, and Sonic Mania. Uh, <gasps> and we'll see what this boss is. Fucking Eggman. Boss. <laughs> Subscribe.